Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts. This is what Wolverine fans have been begging and asking for for a very long time, and we thought we would never get it. And it's happening, it is official, and it's happening at Deadpool 3. Hugh Jackman is wearing the comic fucking accurate suit. Now obviously, there's a lot of different comic, you know, suits or whatever for Wolverine in the comics, but the yellow and blue, the classic that everyone calls the classic, it is here. And here's what I appreciate the most about this is that they could have easily said, okay, we're going to do yellow and blue, but we're going to add another color. We're going to make some changes. We're going to kind of hide the yellow because one of the main criticisms against this in live action is the yellow probably will just be too goofy. It might not work. Well, to pretty much everybody responding online saying it looks amazing, and it does. It works so damn well, and I appreciate that they did not adapt it or change it. Of course, they added the sleeves or whatever. In some iteration of the comics, he does have sleeves, uh, but they just said, okay, we're going to add more yellow. We're going to keep the yellow in, and we're not going to remove it. I love it. I love it so much. I'm so happy this is happening because I think there is a world, obviously, where this would never have happened because we thought maybe would have, we would have seen Wolverine in Deadpool 1. Okay, it didn't happen. Maybe, maybe Okay, maybe he will appear in Deadpool 2, even though he, re he recently retired because of Logan in 2017. I believe Deadpool 2 in 2018. Yeah, so there was a chance... No. So now it's happening in Deadpool 3. Of course, it makes the most sense with him in 3 or whatever with the you know claws. It just it's perfect. It's perfect. Now, the question is how much of a role is he going to have in the movie, Hugh Jackman? Um based on the rumors and stuff we're hearing, cuz there's going to be a lot of different people in this movie depending on who you believe, but I think Hugh Jackman is going to have a significant role. I don't feel like he's going to just pop for a couple of scenes. I feel like he's going to have a significant part in this movie. It sounds like it's going to be a Deadpool Wolverine multiversal travel film. We'll see how that plays out. But I'm so happy this came out. Now, obviously, when it was first released, uh, Ryan Reynolds put out a kind of grainier, kind of not blurry, but it just wasn't the greatest quality image on Instagram stories. And thankfully, on Instagram, Deadpool's official Instagram, and then on Twitter as well. And, I, and even Hugh Jackman tweeted out the original version, which wasn't the best, but now we have this HD quality version. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. I love it so much. I, I can't get enough of it because it's actually happening. It is actually happening. Now, here's hoping, right? Here's hoping that the actual mask, because we have that's the one thing we haven't seen. Now, I think we're going to get one. I think we're going to get the mask. We're going to get that. How's it going to look after the full suit reveal? Because it's one thing when you have an image. It's another thing when it's in motion and footage and post-production and all that. Because that's just something people kind of forget at times when you see set photos. Now, obviously, this is a very good shot, obviously. But they released this officially. It wasn't like this came out from somebody who was taking a shot or something on set. Because I bet if a, a photo from whatever they were shooting here came out from somebody like up a hill or something on image or whatever, and it's like their quality camera and it's not an official release, it's a blurry, you know, some just fan or whatever, somebody's got an image, it wouldn't look like this. It wouldn't look like this. So we'll see. We'll see. But this is a great first start, I think, to officially marketing and getting the, the fans hyped because this is a way you do it. Okay, because I, I can tell you right now, if because it would have leaked, it would, not, it would not have looked like this. So they're getting ahead of it and marketing it, and it looks amazing. So what do you guys think of the image? I'm curious to know your thoughts. Are you guys excited for the comic accurate suit? Let me know in the comments below, guys. I cannot wait for this film. Cannot wait. Talk to you guys soon. Peace out.